Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back. It's Brandon with Campbell Fitness and today I'd just like to take a few minutes to talk about, you know, my views on training and also other views out there based off of other fitness YouTubers as well as other things such as print magazines, online resources, people you might talk to in the gym, whatever your own personal experience. The reason I want to put this video out is just to let you know that even though everything that I put out here I try to base off of research and my own personal experience, which has been 16 plus years in the gym, that what I say and do might not necessarily be as beneficial to you. Now again, I try to base this off of research to show what's proven to work, but each individual kind of takes own precedence here. And the reason I want to do this is because even though I say something that may or may not make sense to you, it doesn't necessarily mean that you need to switch to this way of training, this way of thinking, this way of eating. All this is is to put out information to kind of help you see some mistakes that maybe I've seen growing up. And I think that's what a lot of these other YouTubers do as well. So just because necessarily I train a certain way as compared to another person, it doesn't necessarily mean one way is better than the other. Again, I'm trying to base it both off of the results that I've seen and the information that I've read to lead me to come to these conclusions. In the end, you're still going to have to find out what works based for you based off of your schedule, based off your eating habits, your own results, your training level. All these things are going to come into play. Now with this and kind of basing off some of the other things I've talked about in previous videos on this channel, as far as the importance of keeping a workout log, nutrition, certain supplements, training frequency, volume, all of this stuff comes into play. Now regardless of how you train necessarily and how you eat, those all play key roles into the results that you're going to see. However, that's again not to say that you won't see results doing things differently. So in the end, when it comes down to it, the best thing that you guys can do is kind of try a little bit of everything. Do your own research, do your own implementation of some of these theories, give it some time to actually take hold, track these workouts, make sure that you're actually progressing, seeing strength, and what you'll find is over time, you'll find a good catered routine for what works for you based off your own individual preferences. So I hope that makes some sense. Let me know what you guys think about this subject. Let me know some of the things that maybe work for you versus what don't work for you, especially how they apply to some of the theories and some of the things that I bring up on these channels and these videos. So that's all I have to say regarding this video. I hope you guys appreciate it. Look forward to some feedback below. And as always, stay big.